I've never since 1995, I've never been to Kenya. And if I come, it's, 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 it's right there, I let me go to that place. I go home and I come back and I go back to the next day. Since we bought that house, I was living in the UK. Thank you. Now, send the, the children in there. Did you ever claim any of those children? My advocate, I, can I cannot complain those are not mine. Even I don't know them. How can I complain, can I complain against them? I don't know. Don't and the court will assign me, I've never even seen them. So other than the two children, David and Sarah, who are your children, yeah. whom you confirm are your children, the other five who are subject to the proceedings before the court are not known to you? No, David and Sarah, they are my children. Sarah and David are your children. And then you can say No, I never. Has anything, been, has anything been taken before the court to demonstrate that that communication took place? No, I did not call anyone in the authority. No. That were used to communicate that particular information. Has it been tabled before the court? I don't know the telephone number. I don't know whether which number they call in the UK. I don't know. Those are not every. That is not true. Report it was communicated with the uh, with accused. Paul Musoga, who testified in this case, that you called and, uh, and said, uh, These are my miracle babies. Did you ever have that kind of communication? No, I have never called anybody in Kenya, in the police, police or anyone. And again, has that communication been tabled before the court? No. In terms of the phone, the phone contact that were used, no. the no. Thank you. 2004, on twice or three occasions and all that. I think so, maybe twice? Yes. But it was very brief, not more than a week. Yeah. Was your coming to this country? Was your coming to this country? meant for you to have access 